Lonely Attack on the Different World, web novel chapter 79. Since you are so close, it would be unfair not to treat you in the same fashion. Day 32, The Faraway Labyrinth, 75th floor. Since the armored person with a stare that physically hurt didn't need it, I took the Demon Beast bracelet for myself. Even though I was just hitting it from behind, I'm actually the one who defeated that thing. Probably. But I'm troubled by the vagueness of Demon Bra- but I'm troubled by the vagueness of Demon Beast Bracelet increase all abilities. Will it also increase Neat, Hikokomori, or Loner? Anyway, on the 74th floor, I can still feel the prickling from the stair, but it's the 74th floor. Metal Scorpion level 74 are waiting there. Metal Scorpion is, well, a scorpion, which means it's venomous. Scorpions, despite their appearance, are actually pretty soft. What they have is not actually a shell or a carapace. They easily die if smashed, but the metal scorpions are made of metal, so they must be quite tough. I don't think that they will squash that easily. Probably? The answer is fumigation, so once again I'm busy with making fires and spreading smoke. After all, scorpions are arachnids, basically siblings to spiders. Since they are so close, I have to give them the same treatment. Aren't you happy? Lying on their backs with their legs twitching? They probably are. The silver armor is going around stabbing the scorpions into the gaps of the armor in their neck and then removing their heads. Behind it, a dude in a suspicious black hood keeps smoking the surroundings nonstop. No, no, I shouldn't let it bother me. It's my loss if I do, just like working, title-wise. Finishing collecting the stones, it is now time for a pleasant detour to a hidden room. Though there is nothing pleasant about it until now, in terms of my affection points. This chest also wasn't locked. Just when will I get a chance to use the magic key? What do we have here? Enduring Greaves, Complete Resistance, Magical Physical Attacks, Impact Resistance Up, Greater? Greaves? Ah, the Shin Guard. Leg Protection from Western-Styled Armor. Since it's Western-style, I tried to show it to Armored Prez, but she seems to have no interest in it. Is it because they are black? She won't accept anything other than silver? So she picks items based on their appearance. Well, as a girl, she might have some points where she cannot yield. Well... Full silver armor has complete immunity and enhance all on top of it, so she simply might have no use for it. I wonder if I can put these into my boots. Yup, they fused. I'm so happy. This is what I wanted most after affection rating. Complete resistance, physical attacks, and impact resistance up. This means that crash landing and clashes with the enemies will become easier from now on. Though, is it really a good idea to embolden such behavior? But, well, what can I do if I fall in clash? Of course, it would be better if it didn't hurt as much. Yup. I'm itching a bit for some charge attack, or more like, for crashing directly into enemies at full speed. But considering that the next floor is turtles, I probably shouldn't try that. Big turtles with alligator faces? Is that what's called an alligator snapping turtle? But the name says Reflect Turtle, level 73. Four huge turtles are lined up in an excessively huge corridor. Yeah, don't want to crash into that. Each of them is the size of a small house. Probably would be on, probably would be beyond painful. No thank you. Rather than that, it's Reflect. How is Reflect different from the Borsan's mirror? Since they also have Magic Reflect skill, I see no difference. Approaching the first turtle, I use magic to create a hole under its right front leg, and then another one under its left front leg, and then another one under its right back leg, and another one under its left back leg. Here we go, it cannot move anymore. I then hit the head of the turtle, which lost its freedom of movement. Even though it's a turtle, it makes no attempt to retract its head, so I just keep whacking it. It is trying to bite me, but it doesn't have enough reach. Since it is so huge, it blocks the passage, preventing other turtles from coming near. I just keep bludgeoning it. Thud, 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 slash. Armored Prez suddenly cut off its head. She couldn't wait any longer? That turtle had slashing resistance. How could she cut it like that? Well, fine, it saves us some time. She seems to have an impatient side to her. Then another reflect turtle approached us, so I created a hole under its right front leg, and then... It was incredibly tedious. But all of them were annihilated, eight turtles in total. They were so huge that this floor felt smaller than the previous ones, but with all the turtles now gone, I can see how truly huge this floor is. Their magic stones are also huge. I wonder if big magic stones are worth more? Is this actually a treasure? But there are 72 floors between me and the buyout window. Hmm, no hidden room it seems. Let's check what's above. I opened a peephole in the ceiling. No matter how many times I peep through it, it's still not fun at all. Dead trees? Trent, level 72, a wood. There is no need to think here. They don't even have fire resistance, though they do seem to have magical resistance. Wouldn't they burn from a normal, ordinary fire? Bonfire, bonfire. Whoa, that is seriously hot. It's burning well. Well, that's a dry tree for you. 
I splashed them with all kinds of oil, including canola oil, olive oil, and sesame oil, and then set them on fire. What good will having only magic resistance do? I can simply use Airwalk to pour oil on them. Of course they will end up in flames. They are basically monsters made of dry wood asking to be burned. Of course I will oblige, though it's seriously hot. Everyone burned out. Using oil here seems like a waste, though. It's expensive and they don't sell it in such large quantities. Gather magic stones in a flat gaze, then it's time for a hidden room. Hmm? No treasure? Only a piece of dry wood called Elder Trent, level 72? A huge dry tree, and it burns very well. Well, not without my help. When it finally burned down, I discovered Elder Trent Cane, magic power 50% up, elemental affinity increase greater, magic control increase among the remains. A magic staff, huh? I wonder if there's any cane that makes whacking enemies feel better. Isn't blunt damage what people seek from canes? The swords get bonuses to attack strength, but all the canes and staves are getting spellcasting bonuses? Isn't it a weapon designed for beating others to death? No?